Actually, yeah. about we were talking earlier this morning about how how, how woman friendly an environment yes. Dell is from yes. a tech support. Exactly. Uh, from from a, from a technology perspective, that uh, that, that uh, a lot of women executives within yep. Dell. And that's not necessarily always the case with some companies, but this, no, yeah, you know, but I guess the the um, ratio of men to women in, within Dell is a much higher percentage than other companies. Oh, it's definitely like higher. Um, you know, I started with Dell a few years ago, and and I've come from technology, from medical device to technology, yeah. and still continuing in technology, living in Austin, Texas. And oh, you're in Austin? Yep, oh, Austin. Awesome. I'm in Dallas. Oh, nice. Yeah. Love hate relationship with Dallas. I know. Well, <laughs> I love so your fun. city. I oh, know it's a lot of fun. Come to ACL in September. Oh, definitely. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, it's great being um, you know being a woman at Dell. Yeah, you know, it's, it's fantastic. A lot of opportunities, and, and of course, get to come to Orlando and talk to you fine folks. So it's fun. <laughs> well, you got you have done. So you're basically in charge of the Dell Storage Forum. Yeah. Correct? Yep. One of one of the the folks that are in charge of Dell Storage Forum. You have done an awesome job. Oh, thank you. Everybody thank you. I talk to is yeah. having fun. They're learning yeah. so much. Yeah. So I, I can't say enough about that. How has it been from your perspective? Uh -huh. I mean, obviously, running a conference. I think anybody who's ever done that before, I've done that, yeah. is just stressful. Oh, it's stressful. <laughs> it's stressful. And um, my. My, my, my point is always on the customer and the partner. So yeah. the, luckily, I don't see a lot of the, the mayhem in the background, and that's a good thing. And so sure. the, we've grown up a lot. Uh, we started with the Ecologic User Conference uh -huh. uh, a couple of times last year and with, with Compel and brought a lot of their expertise into putting together a user forum like this. And it's been real exciting. A lot of work since we've launched this in February yeah. um, with the combination of the, of the two events and, and seeing it live and seeing the reaction from our partners as well as our customers. It's real exciting. And yeah. you see, you see Dell and the, the our, our brand everywhere, and it's, you it's do. real exciting. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's really exciting. I just like to see people have a good time, but also walk away with a lot of lot of learning. You know, with a lot of great labs. feedback on the hands-on labs. Mm -hmm. Man, yeah, the oh, and this is new. The hands-on labs. This was something that we did ad hoc in San Diego in October last year. So we have Dell Educational Services and their instructor-led trainings that are the uh, pre and post conference this year. We've done it in the past and it's a huge driver okay. for those certification classes and they fill up really quickly. In hmm. fact, four weeks ago, they, they were full. Okay. And so we've had a lot of our customers come like, I really need to get in the class, get in the <laughs> class. And, and so one of our engineers said, you know, we can really develop this lab. Why yeah. don't we just do a lab and can you customers, the 25 folks that were in on the waiting list in okay. October, they put this lab together. Hmm. Nice. B built built a virtual lab, and they said, "You know, let's do that in in June. Let's bring it to Orlando." And now you see the labs, and yeah. you have um, Equalogic Labs. They have a lot of sessions and a lot of um, a lot of a, a huge workbook you can walk through. And then the compellents said, "You know, this is a really good idea. Let's have hands-on labs." And then we really expanded that across all the platforms that we have in in, in the labs and. And of course, our um, our new Ecologic launch that we launched this morning with Darren, you know, their labs are here as well, so you can really get your hands dirty yeah. on a lot of our equipment, a lot of our solutions. So it's a really exciting, exciting point this year. It's new. So so, so you'll be continuing it, obviously, oh, yes, for we people will. coming yes, next will. year. Yes, and, and the engineer future. who decided to do this is, is very proud of himself. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so it's real exciting. You know. Okay. Yeah, it's an exciting aspect to this year. Well, the the vibe so far, you know, has been very relaxed and uh, community yep. oriented, mm -hmm. very, community mm -hmm. driven. Very fluid, I would say. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen the logo Smooth. in the pool? We swam in the pool. I did we, see the pool, <laughs> no, the logo. Yeah. I actually walked outside and was like, oh, they got a logo in yeah. the pool. Yeah. <laughs> I yeah. thought that was cool. Yeah, they yeah. caught us actually when we came in about 11 o'clock at night to, and walked through the little fluid archway mm -hmm. there. It, it surprised us yeah. a bit. Yeah. And yeah. the yeah. kids. And, and yeah, from the kids love it. Being a marketer, we, I've been here since Thursday. And so once they put the uh, went, put the fluid walkthrough in the, right. in the lobby, the kids were loving it. Yeah. And I just started thinking that our customers aren't even here, but just the visibility that, that Dell is getting just totally. in Orlando, just on the families. That's right. The kids are loving it. Yeah. <laughs> the first good. thing I thought of when I saw it, I, I want to know how that's done. Yeah. <laughs> But uh, that's, no, I know you don't know. But that's, uh, you're a geek. that's just the way I work. I was like, oh, I exactly. know how that's done. Can I tell that part? Okay, flushing the toilet. <laughs> so I was like, oh, it's right. running water. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so with everything that's been happening within Dell, um, all the acquisitions, everything, has there been a shift in the company culture itself? Have um, you noticed? Not really. I think that, that with the acquisitions and we. Dell has already been always had an entrepreneurial spirit, yeah. and so when we, when you think of Equal Logic and you think of I've, I was um, just at the cusp of um, of the Equal Logic acquisition and, and been 
very integrated in the, in the mm -hmm. Capellan acquisition. And they, they bring so much value into our culture and we really, I respect that. Yeah. I respect of, of what they bring because sometimes in a, in a larger organization you, you get a little overwhelmed and, and it's very fast paced and, and so they just bring a fresh air yeah. and I think we adapt that really well and, it, and it's, it's refreshing. Tony Parkinson was just saying that there really isn't any, you know, bureaucracy that they have to. Pretty, pretty flat really organization. Pretty flat. Yeah. yeah, yeah, not really. Um, the only, the only um, thing that our, once we once we uh, kicked off the the launch of Compellent, um, they've come down to Austin a lot of times. So, okay. so right. I won't go to Minnesota. During the during the if, winter. If you want, <laughs> oh, come on, winter. no, no, no. If you want to earn real, I'm about right no, now. no, no. You want to earn real points? You go in January. <laughs> right. I'm a Texan Show them through how and through. Uh -huh. I am not tough. Uh -huh. I am not tough. It's just too cold. Oh but, uh, man. But they their first trip here, I think it was 17 degrees in Austin. They're like, I thought you said it was warm here. Oh so, no. But I, I'll be up there in the summer. Okay. So I enjoy their beautiful lakes, and so I think in a couple of weeks I'll be I'll be oh, up good. in Minnesota yeah. with them. So. Good. But it's fun. I'm, I look forward to it. Yeah. Yeah. And that's what I. I always hear is that that come the culture of entrepreneurship mm -hmm. you know I always I hear about that within you know from Dell employees and, and outside of it but um, you know it, how how does a company and from your perspective who you've worked with keep that going like what is it about Dell that stops the bureaucracy from coming in just the values obviously but how do you kind of keep that going I think it's top down, and yeah. I think it's. I mean, I know um, my manager and, and Darren really empowers us to be individuals, and he empowers us to really think um, strategically, but also uh, be creative. Yeah. And and it really is. Um, I, I love coming to work every day because I can see my friends and my family, and I think that you see that now here at the forum is that you know I, my friends in Nashua that are my coworkers, my friends in Minnesota. This is a place that we can come together. Yeah. And, and it is friends and family. And we take that same philosophy even with our partners and our customers is that this is, we're bringing our closest yeah, friends and family me. together. Yeah. So not only do we have that here in Orlando, but we have it in Austin. We have it in Minnesota and Nashua and even our new design center in, on the West Coast. So, so it's just, it's from top down. You know, it's an open door policy yeah. with Darren, with my executives, with my managers, all the folks that I report to. It's, you know, you walk up to our, their cubicles, literally, you know, it's <laughs> Dell. <laughs> Nobody has a closed door. Uh, so you walk up to them and it's, you know, it's, you know, we just really, okay. you know, we hug it out. Not to sound it, yeah. not sound too, too warm and fuzzy. Um, but we're keeping woman, this warm and fuzzy no, 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 no. We were talking, theme throughout today, aren't yeah, we? Yeah, we have exactly. social responsibility <laughs> themes yeah. going. We were, talk, we were talking to Phil and we were yeah. Yeah. And Darren about social responsibility <laughs> and contributions and things mm -hmm. like that, places where we're trying to make a difference. I've so. even yeah. heard that, you know, Michael himself, you know, will... Well, he has his own charity as well. Uh, right, yeah, his he own, has his, his own, own charity, his own, yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. yeah. Yep. And then he's very close with employees, or he's very yep. open, and mm -hmm. you know, even on on my side of things, uh, he participates in social media. Yep. Just he, he himself, loves he the, actually yeah. tweets. He loves the Twitter. Yeah, I, no, and, I, <laughs> and I have a couple of clients who've emailed him directly, and they get a response back yeah. almost yeah. immediately. You almost know, what's like. interesting about that is that we did our first um, Dell Storage Forum in um, March in Dallas last year. And he wasn't scheduled to attend. Okay. So us being the, I'm, in my real job, I'm in product marketing. So uh. <laughs> my real life is, is is the product side. So, you know, I'm packing a box and okay. who knows what I look like. And all of a sudden I get a tap on the shoulder shoulder, and it's, and it's Michael. Oh. He surprised us on the last day. Like, and, Oops, should have worn makeup. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, God, I hope I looked all right. Um, but, you know, he surprised. And, what, and how it happened was that through the social media aspect, he saw a lot of our customers. Oh, this is the best conference ever. This is a real so user forum. And so he was on the Twitter. And, <laughs> and, he, sh and he was coming to Dallas. Apparently he has some high friends in Dallas. So he just, he just showed up to see what was going on. Nice. And he yeah. surprised a lot of our, our classes. They walked in and, and some of our bloggers and some of our, our, our customers really got to got to meet him and just, That's hey, great. how's it going? So he's he's very approachable. Yeah. And he um, not only is he approachable, but the rest of our executives. And again, it just comes from the top down of being very open and, and community-like. That's very cool. I hope that continues. Mm -hmm. and, I mean, you yeah. guys have been around years. for yeah. 25 years, so uh -huh. I, obviously it will. Uh -huh. yeah. Are, are you um, are you going to do more events throughout the course of the year? What, what events are you going to be visible at? Yeah, definitely. Um, so, so our, our, our direction of for, for the forum is we're definitely going to take it to Europe. You so, are. Okay. Yeah, we've. When is that going to be? Um, hopefully this fall. Okay. Fall, if not early winter. 
Uh, so that's what uh, we're We know we're, that you like winter, so yes. you want to get it in the exactly. fall. <laughs> so, um, in the Nordic countries, I assume. Yes, I think yeah. we're going to go to Iceland, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, yeah, so we're, we're definitely, um, from a long-term perspective, we're looking definitely having one large forum um, on each of the continents. So okay. we're definitely developing that strategy. You'll definitely see us next year um, okay. here in the U.S. Um, in the fall in, in Europe. So we're definitely getting there. And, and obviously, you know, learning from a, each year as you go and each conference as you go, um, what are the things next year outside of the labs right, right. <laughs> that you'll probably implement or hope to, if you can talk about that mm -hmm. a little? Um, again, we're still in early phases. We've learned a lot mm -hmm. um, coming together uh, from, you know, two, two forums, bringing it together to, to make this one. We've definitely learned a lot. But again, the big driver is, is certification. You know, the, I think yeah. the technical content at this conference is unbeatable, mm -hmm. um, but more of it. Okay. You know, more technical content, more certification. Uh, a big driver is, yeah, it's a great conference, but how do I um, inform my boss and, and get the budget to come down here? You know, Travel tight. It's interesting so. because I would say VMware, among all the communities, has probably done the best job mm -hmm. of creating a, a culture around being a VMware certified design expert, mm -hmm. being a VMware. Yeah, uh, okay. uh, uh, yep. uh, V expert, right? That right. sort of thing. Yep. So, so, are you? Do you? We're see taking some of that methodology. Okay. I, it, it's a huge driver, and we know that the sessions from the they, they start on on Tuesday morning and end on on Thursday. That's strong technical content, but creating that into. Um, I don't know, sorry, a title, but um, into being that expert mm -hmm. really drives the managers back home in these companies to say, you really need to attend this conference because you're going to um, learn how to use your equipment already. You know, yeah. the, what, yeah. what you've already purchased, how do you leverage that? Um, with Equalogic, you have a lot of built-in software capabilities that sometimes you don't really take advantage of. So you can learn how to do that here at this conference. Mm -hmm. And again, that'll that'll pay for your ticket next year. Right. right. <laughs> and and yeah. we don't tell the managers this, but you guys do a fantastic job yeah. at the parties. <laughs> exactly, I've enjoyed myself. <laughs> the blue well, cocktails. Blue co I did uh, not see those. you didn't see the blue no, cocktails? No, I didn't. Oh. No, we were it working. It was the Dell Fusion, I think, was the signature uh -huh. drink. Oh, that's cute. I didn't get to have one. Michael, if you're listening. <laughs> <laughs> She's been totally yeah. on cue. Well, thank you so much. Like I said, fantastic job here. Thank and you. everybody seems to be enjoying themselves, yep. which is key to yep. a conference. It's key. You, you, you work hard, but you also are able to enjoy yourself. Yeah, evening, exactly, so. exactly. Well, it was well nice thank meeting you, here. Christy. It was great to meet you. Nice to meet you as well. <laughs> Take care. No worries. Thank you. Pleasure. Bye. Thanks.